name is Rhonda Stevens. I'm the carton resource here at the Frito-Lay plant in Frankfort, Indiana. We are about ready to install a new Max Pack Beeler, which I'm excited about and uh, ready to improve our quality and our bale size and weights, um, hopefully early, later today. Uh, we weren't getting the weights from our bales. They, we, it's supposed to have four wire ties on them. They would come out with anywhere from one to three, and then we would have to manually tie the other ones because you saw how much of a mess it made for a warehouse for the material handlers to have to drive through all that scrap and cardboard that was laying on the floor. Uh, and uh, fortunately, we had the vertical baler that we use for the shrink wrap. Yeah, we're looking for a lot better quality bales with the Auto Tie Max Pack baler. We put the one in over at the core plant a couple weeks ago and it's working great. We're seeing a lot more bales coming out. Um, we're getting a lot of nice bales from there and uh, good quality. All five wires are coming out very tight and you know the bales are basically like concrete. They are so tight. This way being able to throw the totes in the baler I'm able to get the revenue out of it instead of having to ship it out and someone else getting the revenue for it. So. And what, what about your zero landfill stuff? What, what's the next step? Just trying to get more recycled. We're, we're at like 0.75% going to the landfill. So a huge improvement over yes. the last couple of years. So just, uh, we actually do dumpster dives. We'll go and see what we're throwing in there uh -huh. and seeing, you know, what can we take out of there and see who can recycle that for right, us. Right, right. So.